Yo, what is up you guys? Welcome back to another video and for today's video we have absolutely crazy Roblox news to get to today. Like how Roblox is now going to allow anybody to publish UGC items. Bruh. Like people are now able to upload a UGC item if they want to. Uh, and Roblox is allowing players to save stuff onto their inventory with whatever they create in a certain game, which is just absolutely groundbreaking news. But before we start this video guys, I'm about to ask if we can 20 likes on this video if we get 20 likes on this video everybody that likes this video will get a ferrari okay a ferrari will pop up in your garage if you like today's video but anyways let's get on to today's video so the first thing i do want to go over for today is how anybody is now able to upload ugc items and this is absolutely insane so as you can see from rtc when you try to make an avatar item roblox now gives a prompt that id verification is required to unlock the ability to save 3d ugc from studio and put it on sale. Roblox may be experimenting with public UGC. Some people are either saying they can or can't sell 3D UGC content. As of now, there are no known uploads of public UGC. So basically, Roblox is slowly rolling out to everyone to be able to make their UGC items and even publish it for people to buy. Uh, some people do not have this update yet just because of it is still rolling out. Like it's still in beta. The process is still rolling out to some players. So if you do not have it, don't worry. Roblox will give it to you probably very soon. Basically, yeah, anybody can now create UGC items and publish it to the catalog. So I am going to be expecting a lot of copied items on a catalog page like everything is just going to be copies and copies like we're already seeing that with ugc limiteds a lot of ugc limiteds are just copied uh you know it would sucks like i just wish people would make something creative like that would be nice like as you can see here from david public ugc will be a disaster roblox can't even moderate ugc when you literally have to apply for it and as you can see here in the picture yeah there's literally a copied version of a valk like this is not even real like some person just made it made a valk which is i think think against roblox rules i matter of fact i think roblox even said that they will ban people that make ugc items that resemble original limiteds like the Valk. i think that's even bannable but roblox so far hasn't been actually like fully taking down these items these items keep appearing and more keep appearing like copied items are just everywhere uh we'll see if roblox does anything in the future but as of now yeah there's a lot of copied items out there that are coming and once everyone's able to make udc's there's going to be so much more copied items items in the avatar marketplace and i'm just like ready for disaster like let me know down in the comments below on your thoughts about everyone being able to make UGC items like what do you think about that let me know down in the comments below but yeah anyways as you can see here in the image that RTC provided oh uh, yeah people are able to create avatar items from creations and but if you do want to make a UGC item you have to verify your identity basically by you know providing your passport wow. or driver's license or government ID so as you can see here verify your ID to unlock the ability to save 3D UGC from studio and put it on sale so basically like voice chat uh you have to provide provide your ID to verify with Roblox. I guess your identity is real so yeah so i don't know if people will do this just to upload a ugc item i mean i guess people will but me personally i i don't see myself using this i don't see myself going far enough to give them my id just to upload ugc like i don't even care about making ugc so i'm definitely not going to be doing this but if you guys are interested head over to your creations page and go to avatar items and see if you have the ability to create ugc items uh anyways we're going to be getting on to our next news for today and that is Roblox is allowing people to create anything they want and save it to their uh, inventory. Huh? So as you can see here from Bloxy News, Roblox is releasing a new API that will allow users to save creations they make and experiences as packages to their inventory. Creators will have full control to specify which objects can be saved. And as you can see here in the image, basically, yeah, you can create stuff in a, in a game in Roblox and you can actually save it to your inventory, like into your Roblox Studio inventory and use that item that you made in the game into studio if you want to which is just groundbreaking like i've never even thought about even seeing this happen like i don't think anybody saw this coming but this is pretty cool like you can actually make something in a game on roblox and save it to your studio like that's pretty cool i'm not gonna lie so as you can see here from a different image as well you can see saying made an experience from creation demo arena so yeah 
So you can make stuff in a in a game on Roblox and save it to your inventory, like either through I guess uh, the studio. But anyways, all assets that were created from within the experience will be attributed to their source experience whenever users see them on a platform. When users click on the attribution link to the original experience, they will be redirected to the experience page. Basically everything you create from a game that you made uh, will be credited. Like it will say this item was made by whoever made it in a game and it will list the game that the user made in uh, to make that item. But yeah, you can, yeah, I, I don't really know how to explain this news, but it's just simple. You create something in a game and you can save it to your studio, uh, which is groundbreaking. Like people are freaking out about this like this is really huge news but uh anyways you guys that is gonna be it for today's video if you have enjoyed this video today make sure to slap that like button and that red sub button to support me and my channel and also make sure to join my discord server which will be linked in the pinned comments below but anyways you guys i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out make sure to subscribe and click on the notification bell if you have enjoyed this video let us know in the comments below what you would like to see next.